lovely weather we're having. Welcome to Hey EW, I am RJ City, and my guest is Minoru Suzuki. Hey! Huh? I'll take it. <clears throat> Let's move on. You're often referred to as murder grandpa. The, the median age of criminals in the U.S. is now 38, a decade older than it was in 1970. Do you feel partially responsible for the aging crime epidemic? Mm -hmm. I, and... No. Okay. We'll, we'll figure that out in post. And lest we forget Ray and Faye Copeland. They killed a bunch of drifters, and then they were sentenced to death at age 76 and 68. How do you feel about that? Okay. 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 Well, well uh, you know what? Let me throw out some alternatives to murder grandpa that might be a little more accessible. Huh? Tell me how you feel about these. Abuelo assassin? Huh? Uh, slappy grandpappy? Nani? No. Okay. Oh, this is a fun one. Oh, no, no, no. Nani, oh, no. no, and then finally, oh, don't drop the soap. Uh, no, no, whichever one you want. Huh? It's, it's up to you. <clears throat> if someone had to sue Zuki, what do you think a court would hold you legally liable for? Hi. Huh? Okay, you got a clean record. You co founded Pancrase. Huh? Huh? The, the, the renowned mixed martial arts uh, promotion? Mm. Mm hmm. As someone who has run an MMA promotion, how are you not an asshole? You know? You're, you're, you're not. And I feel like that's the executive position for obnoxiousness. So it surprises me. See? Yeah. <clears throat> okay, we'll move on. The Pancrase style is based on the ancient Greek Olympic Pancration fighting style, though they did that completely in the nude. How would your fighting style change if our genitals were out? Yeah, yeah if we were like this, you know? <laughs> I should like to put that in the Kimura lock. Huh? Your first ever pancreas loss was to fellow deadly eccentric Boss Rutten? Yes? Nani? Yes? Nani? Oh, Nani? Nani? Okay. Of course, he went on to have a kid. Hmm? Nani? Oh, okay. That's fine. I just, I, just, I just wanted to know, you know. Well, well, he went on to have a cameo role in The King of Queens. Do you think all those years ago, if you avoided his liver shots, it would have been you standing next to Kevin James and Leah Remini? Eh? That was peak Leah Remini before the whole Scientology thing. I, I got more. I have more. I did research. I got research. Um, uh, Tekken. Tekken. Uh, uh, you were the character of King? Eh? You did motion capture for Tekken, the video game. Uh, uh, he was a wrestler, which is a stretch. He was from Mexico, appropriation. Uh, he wore a realistic Jaguar mask. You know, and you did motion capture for it. You did great, but I wish you did more with the feline part of it. You know, that kind of thing. Okay. Not a big Tekken man. Is your violent style at odds with your impeccable sense of fashion? Yeah. You don't see Ralph Lauren slapping the shit out of people and then putting them in sleeper holes, do you? What Let's talk about the socks. Huh? You wear beautiful, wonderful, fun socks. I see them on your Instagram. Does this bother you that I have no socks? Is it too provocative? I'm so I can cover it. I can cover them up. Is this, is this better? I'm sorry. I apologize. <clears throat> when you go to the barber, what do you ask for? Okay. Are you sometimes wear a fedora too? You know, and I go back to the how are you not an asshole? Because on paper you think you are, but you're not. Huh? If somebody else dressed like you, they would be outside of a nightclub with a pager on their hip. This is why I think you make it work. And stop me if I'm being too analytical. It's because you're so confident in your ability to kill people that you can relax and enjoy yourself. Yeah. See, I, I have the opposite problem. If anyone on this screen is going to die, it's most likely me. So I can't relax and enjoy I'm not going to die now. No. Okay. Okay. Yes. Okay. No. 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 I meant no. Maybe. Maybe. Sometimes. Maybe. Sometimes. Sometimes. Yeah. You come to the ring with a full-size towel. Do you use it to dry off afterwards? You, you put it over yourself, you walk back right into the shower, and then you've been, you're in bed by 9 p.m.? No, 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 no. Okay. Well, it's just a waste of a towel. Was it a burden being the leader of Suzuki Goon because it's named after you? 
Huh? If anyone has a problem with Suzuki Goon, they would have to come right to you. Was that annoying? Suzuki Goon, I know, but I don't know what to say. Yeah. Well, with Bullet Club, you have a little leeway. You know, there's so many people. They're always changing leaders. You're like when Paul Newman named his salad dressing Newman's own. If the balsamic is sour, you're going to talk to Paul. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Do you have a favorite salad dressing? Huh? Uh, fishing? Fish? You like to fish? Fishing. Fishing? Good. Fishing, yeah. Uh, I, got, I got nothing on fishing. Ah, okay, you know what? This is what I don't understand. Uh, we can go fishing if you want. Yes, ah, 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 yeah, okay. We can do a little a mime routine. You are a, a badass wrestler. You're the most legitimate, credible wrestler of the past 35 years. Yet, you also wrestle people like Mecha Mummy, who's a robot. You pile drive him in a river. How come nobody's yelling at you? See, if anyone here does something mildly humorous, they get yelled at. You get away with it. I want to know why. Well, there's the answer. Was Andre the Giant hot? Huh? That's a maybe. You come out to the song Kaze Ni Nare, right? Loosely translated means become the wind. Right? But. If we're talking about powerful wind songs, there's a lot better options out there. What about The Summer Wind by Frank Sinatra? My Fickle Friend, The Summer Wind? That's not bad. What about um, Summer Breeze by Seals and Croft? Blowing in the Jasmine of My Mind? That's a good one. <sighs> you know, for a fella who doesn't gab too much. I, I, I got more. I got more. Um, okay, less? You want less? Well, I, I want to talk about your faces. You, you have a facial expression not unlike uh, the great Jim Varney. I'm going to throw out some emotions. Give me the Suzuki face. Okay? Huh? Yeah, let's begin. Nine. Melancholy. Huh? Okay? It, it's an interesting choice. Uh, bewildered. Huh? Great. Exuberant. What are you doing? Uh, irked. What is that? That's a good one. And finally, peeved. Huh? That's a good one, too. You know what? We tried our best. I, I'm sorry. I, I really don't think we, we hit it. I thought we were going to meet in the middle. I thought we were going to hit it off. It doesn't matter what I asked this person. I might as well ask him who his favorite actor is in Wings. Huh? You got a favorite actor in Wings? Huh? Wings. They show Wings. You ever see Wings? Not any Wings. Wings. Uh, it's like Cheers, but in an airport. Huh? Do you have a favorite actor in Wings? Actor. Yes. Huh? Wings. A favorite actor in Wings. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, no, no, I'm sorry. No, no. Sorry, I made a mistake. I made a mistake. I'm sorry. I'm just a big Wings fan. No, I was just wondering. No, no, I was just, I'm wondering. Sorry. No, 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 please. Please. Tony Shalhoub. Tony Shalhoub. Tony Shalhoub, yes. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, Tony Shalhoub. Oh, my. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Well, well, uh, this has taken flight. It was, uh, it was rough going. Tony Shalhoub. What a And we finally found some Shalhoub. Thank you. Tony Shalhoub.